want to be on the receiving end of that punch. All right, let's check back in with Mari, who's with Team Sudabashi. Megabots' team has Kratos' weakness has been all. Do you have anything to say about it? I don't know if I can say that. We are a Japanese robot. We can't win. That's right. So, do you want to fight today? えー、メガボッツと戦うことがドキドキするというよりも。Versus Karatis. Let's meet the box. Our tale of the tech. Iron Glory, 15 feet tall when standing, weighs six tons, powered by a 24 horsepower engine. It's loaded with cannon ammunition and a missile launcher. Karatis weighed four tons initially. It's been upgraded to six and a half tons. Most significantly, the addition of a half ton punching arm. Powered by an 87 horsepower engine, it reaches a top speed of 18 miles per hour. And now we go down to the battlefield. On one side, Team USA, Megabots Incorporated with Iron Glory. On the other side, we have Team Japan, Tsurabashi Heavy Industry with Karatis. We are set for this historic first ever battle between two giant fighting robots. Science fiction comes to life. Karatis, Iron Glory, here we go. It looks like Iron Glory is standing up while Karatis proceeds forward relentlessly. He wants to close the distance as quickly as possible. Look at that left arm come off. They're looking for the highlight reel knockout. Closing in. And you got him. Firing. Got him. Karatis utilizing his speed advantage. And it's over. Just like that. And here comes the Megabots crew. Let's hope Matt and Gear are OK. Gear is out of the cockpit. This was a stunning defeat for Team Megabots. Matt seems to be fine as well. Give him there. Nobody smells gasoline. I'm like shaking right now. Okay. Yeah. Quite a volume, guys. That sucked. Let's go down to Mari. She's caught up with Sudabashi.本当に打ちましたね。どういう気分ですか今。怖かった。もうなんかもう手ちょっと震えちゃって。もう中に入ってる時クラタスと心合体した感じしました。いやもうそれどころじゃなかったね。もうよくわかんないからとりあえずまっ
I mean, they got in close. Did what he was gonna do. You, you've got Eagle Prime coming in now. It was built for this exact battle. How do you think your strategy is gonna change? We have the weight advantage for the next robot. I'm hoping the next battle goes better. Good luck to you guys. Thanks. Back to you, Mike. So it's one nothing Japan, Karadasan, and Team Tsurabashi. Sara, remember we talked earlier about how Karadis was specifically designed to break down or take out Iron Glory. And it's no surprise, they utilize their speed advantage and a very precise attack. But now it's prime time. Time for Eagle Prime. And this Megabot is certainly built for metal to metal combat. I mean, it has so many upgrades. It can fire six times the cannonballs. It has modular weapons and software upgrades. All right, tell me about these software upgrades and what we can expect to see. If you think about it like robot anatomy, Iron Glory had to manually control every muscle. So one, two, three, it's a little bit slow. Right. Eagle Prime, however, can actually have coordinated joint movements. And they have eight pre-programmed moves. So all Matt has to do is push a button and it will do an uppercut. The Americans, Team Megabots, looking to even the score. And we've got the best seat in the house. It's time for duel number two. Eagle Prime versus Karatis, our tale of the tech. And we focus solely on Eagle Prime. 16 foot tall when standing, weighs 12 tons, twice as heavy as Iron Glory. And you want to talk about an upgrade, it's 18 times more powerful, from 24 to 430 horsepower. And don't forget, it's bottom heavy. 60% of its weight is in its base. Karatis. Eagle Prime, here we go. And there's the horn. Karatis moving in, taking cover behind that wall of barrels. This is the best it's ever felt. Eagle Prime gets off the first shot, but it looks like it breaks up inside the barrel. The second shot is effective, exposing Karatis to another attack. Keep going, keep going. I want to close in on him. Eagle Prime crashes through the barrels. I bet you they can't even feel that. That robot is 12 tons. And there's a third shot. Okay, I hit him. I don't know if it's doing anything, but I hit him. How about this? Karatis launches a drone. He launched a drone. Keep going, keep going. I see it. Don't let it distract you. They've spotted it. They're going to try to knock it out. And they make contact with it. It's on. It's, it's stuck on the cockpit. Look at that, smoke is pouring out of the drone. He's coming, I see him coming on the monitors. Uh, get me to the car, let's block him with the car, let's block him with the car. Landing a huge right hook on the top vehicle there, and it comes crashing down. Nice, 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 nice. Team Megabots is really taking advantage of the 430 horsepower that they have. That allows Matt and Guy to really control the arena with that arm. Okay, go around, go around the car, a little more. Billy clearing it. All right, he's coming for Eagle Prime, Karatis, engage in close combat. A big body shot by Karatis. Keep in mind, that steel arm, fist is 600 pounds. And another body shot. Karatis looking to do damage. Eagle Prime counters with the claw. Oh, firing a big shot. That yeah, connects. And another. Eagle Prime targeting the midsection of Karatis. Oh, check this out. Eagle Prime using that cannon as a battering ram, targeting the area on Karatis that has a lot of sensitive electronics. I don't think he can move. Eagle Prime continuing to do damage with that cannon. These armor panels are being torn off of Karatis. The robot stopped. The robot stopped. Going safe. Locking out. Wait a second. Engine off. All right, the robots the now appear to be stuck. All right, we really need to swap this cannon out. So Karatis and Eagle Prime are basically stuck. In fighting terms, they're stuck in the clinch. Right, it looks like they hit the e-stop, which immediately shut down both robots. So now it's time to reset, retool, and continue the duel. 
All right, let's check back in with Mari, who's with Karata-san. Karata-san, もうイーグルプライム殴りましたね。どんな感じでした？殴ったね。<笑>ガンガン感触もあったし、多分多少は聞いたと思うけど、やっぱりちょっと、ね、体重負けしてる気がするね。<笑>そうですね。で、あの目つぶし作戦はどう思いました？よよく行きました？そこまでは規定通りうまくいってる。ただその後がちょっとうまくない、うん。うん。で、次のラウンドに入るんですけども、この指大変もう残念ですよね。相当ダメージが起こってます。やっぱ物作る人にはね、ちょっと手って結構象徴的だから、ちょっと屈辱感じるし、なんかやっておりますよ。こんなダメージ起こってるんですけども、まだ勝てますか？大丈夫、僕はします。<笑>かっこいいです。頑張ってください。Let's take a look at the Duel 2 replay. After a cannon malfunction, Eagle Prime gets off a beautiful shot. You can see Karada's armor took a hell of a beating from the opening shot. Karatis counters with the distraction technique, utilizing a drone. But that doesn't stop Eagle Prime from delivering a massive blow to the Tower of Cards, leaving a trail of destruction in the arena. Karatis moved in and delivered a punch of its own, slamming into that front grill of Eagle Prime as the two robots squared off point blank. Eagle Prime using the cannon any way it can to get an advantage, but these robots are locked together and had to be reset. Let's check back in with Mari, who's with Team Megabot. You guys, how was that? That is how it's done. You grab them, you beat the shit out of them. Yeah, you guys had some crazy punches. I, for all of us who don't get to be in that, what is it? What is that like? Yeah, it's pretty incredible. You're getting rocked around. Uh, it's it's kind of a little bit scary as you're kind of anticipating, am I going to fall over if I grab them or if I push too hard? So. Uh, there's a lot to think about, kind of how you're landing those attacks.、Uh, I can only live vicariously through you guys. Now, what did you think of Karatis's secret weapon? When I saw it launch, I just remember yelling at Guy, saying, "There's a drone! There's a drone!"、Uh, and I really wasn't prepared to see things coming from the sky. But、uh, my first reaction was just like, "Get the claw up! Try to swat it!" Looks like I hit it, but it ended up on the cockpit anyways. Now I see there's a weapon swap going on. What can we expect from Team Megabots? So I think we realized that once we get in close, the cannon、uh, isn't that effective. I was trying to use it as a battering ram as we were kind of entangled there, but I think we、That's、need、right. to focus on something that can deal a little more damage up close. I think it's time for some like good old-fashioned American melee. I think that's where this is going. There you go. Very excited to see you guys. Good luck. Thank、Thanks. you. Both robots are now reset and ready. All right, let's do this. Eagle Prime, Karatis. Here we go. All right, moving forward. Karatis getting into position, turning slightly, and Eagle Prime takes the lead here, knocking over barrels with that powerful chainsaw. Let's go. That's a four-foot, forty-horsepower chainsaw, and it was originally designed to cut through rock. We'll see how Karatis attempts to deal with this attack. Okay, he's moving. He's firing. He's firing. Those six barrels can fire up to 2,000 rounds per minute. That could easily take out Eagle Prime's cameras. Are those paintballs? What are you thinking? Okay, move over to that light truck. Let's try something. Wow, Eagle Prime has grabbed the lighting truck. It's all coming down, folks. Karatis keeps unloading on Eagle Prime relentlessly. Oh my God! What? Go. Oh, that's awesome. That's ridiculous. Do anything about this? Nice. And Sara, that truss gets tossed to the side. Eagle Prime approaches Karatis, and now it appears a shoving match is taking place. 
That chainsaw is now activated. Locking up on his hand. Bumpers are failing. Taking it down systematically. Oh my Man, God, they're coming our way. I don't, I what don't are you think... worried about? You're the no. robotics expert. That's why I'm scared. I think what we are you go. talking about? Can he get the finish right oh here? My God. Wow! We're getting close, this man. This is crazy. No, I don't. What? No. What? What? I think. I think. Hold up! No, no, get the out of here. I have never seen anything like this. The chainsaw is still eating away at Karatis' shoulder. And we have a winner. Team Megabots, Eagle Prime. That's how it's done, baby! You know, it's really amazing, the turn of events that has happened here. Karatis came out so strong in that first fight, toppling Iron Glory almost immediately. But then the momentum shifted to Team Megabots. Eagle Prime went on the aggressive, utilized that chainsaw for an outstanding finish. Here comes Karata Sun, showing great sportsmanship. Big smiles all around, a true class act. History has been made. Pretty good, pretty good. Uh, obviously things uh, went pretty well for us there. Uh, we've got an awesome team. I wanted to thank uh, everybody who helped put this together. Um, it's it's it crazy. Awesome. It was just an amazing experience. Both fights, I think, were just out of this world. It's what we've been waiting for. This is it. And Kurata-san, one more time. It was What does the future hold? Uh, I think it's time to make this a sports league. I think it's time to get some rules, some weight classes, bring this show on the road. Let's do it. Good fight. Uh, Worth it. Thank you. Thank you. What an amazing spectacle. Back to you, Mike. So when it is all said and done, Eagle Prime wins the goal at this first ever giant robot fight. For Sara Nadiri and Mari Takahashi, this is Mike Goldberg saying so long from the steel mill in Japan. <laughs>